What's going on YouTube? It's Death Hog here and today we're gonna be talking about whether or not face off should return in Modern Warfare 3 or not. And yeah, so you guys if, if you don't know, Modern Warfare 3 had a DLC game mode called Face Off. Actually it wasn't DLC, but it was added in late in the Modern Warfare 3 life cycle. I guess they were trying to like keep the game fresh by adding in new game mode and such. And uh, I guess it kinda works. It was pretty it was a 2v2, 3v3, 1v1 game mode. It used its own maps, which I really didn't enjoy. So, none of the maps, like Terminal, Dome, you could not use any of those for face off. So, you would have to, you would be forced to use the two free DLC maps that they gave out for this uh, game mode, which is a ground and a rose, and you're watching a rose right now. And by the way, the gameplay is. Drummer Nick 4's first Moab on Erosion, so thank you, Nick, for letting me use this. Actually, you have no idea I'm using this, so it'll be a surprise. Okay, so, yeah, so, Ero uh, Face Off was, like I said, small maps, small gameplay, slow gameplay, not a lot of players, a lot of boosters, and it was pretty fun for a little while, and then you would just keep getting to lobbies, and be like, hey, guys, you want to boost? And we're just like, nope. And it was kind of pointless how they had... These maps for 3v3, but they used regular maps for 4v4 or Team Tactical, so it really didn't make that much sense, but I guess... I mean, they could have just restricted the amount of maps they could use. Like, they could only use smaller maps, like... I gotta think now, Dome... Uh, whatever smaller maps were in. Because, uh... Actually, actually, they could just put, uh... 3v3... Uh, sorry, my voice. 3v3 could have been regular maps. 2v2, 1v1, they could use tiny maps or such. Because in yeah, cause Team Tactical, they use regular maps. 3v3 should be able to use regular maps, I guess, because Team Tactical was possible with three players. So that was a bad decision on Infinity Ward's part. But when does Infinity Ward ever make a good decision? Um, the world may never know. So. What they should do in Ghost, if they do decide to bring it back, I mean, it wasn't on the list of game modes that they were bringing back, but either was Capture the Flag, uh, Ground War, uh, I don't know, there was another one not on there. Capture the Flag, Ground War, this, uh, Face Off, but I'm pretty sure Ground War, I'm not so sure about Capture the Flag, because they do have Blitz now, but... Ah, uh, Blitz doesn't look that good as cap compared to Capture the Flag, where you have to actually take the flag back. It's just more of like, hey, let's see how fast we can just rush into their spawn and run into that. I mean, uh, it's not going to be that great of a game mode, I guess. But back to Face Off. Yeah, so, if it does decide to bring it back in Ghost, they should just use regular maps, like... I don't know, do we, do we, I don't even know if we know any map names that, uh... That Baseball, Strike Zone, Strike Zone. They should just use Strike Zone. That, that baseball map that we saw in the uh, reveal trailer. Just put some, like, shelves or whatever on some areas, block some areas off, so you're only inside the stadium, I guess. Like, shut the doors or so, something like that to block off certain areas of the map so you cannot access them. This game mode, sorry. And that would work a lot better because people wouldn't have to buy DLC maps to use to play a variety of maps in Face Off. They could choose the maps that they've already played, learned strategies for, and love. Because, first of all, they, they look pretty damn cool as ghosts. So if they brought them back, it wouldn't be that much of a, uh... If they moved it to Face Off, probably wouldn't probably, probably take them all of, like, ten minutes to go shut a door in a map and call it a new map. And then they could just uh, drag them to the Face Off game type. And then possibly... They'll bring back uh, Team Tactical and put that in uh, Face Off because, as uh, most of you guys know, Team Tactical was not included in Black Ops 2 because they had League Play, which was 4v4, but it was not the same. I enj I love League Play, but it, it was not Team Tactical. Team Tactical, you just got your friends, and you just uh, pub stomped in 4v4, which was honestly a lot of fun. I probably had more fun in that with uh, the four guys than I did Face Off because different maps, not as enjoyable maps, like Erosion, slow paced game, uh, slow gameplay, only three guys, it's the same three guys that you just keep killing over and over again, like you just get used to these, like, like oh, he just killed me with his ACR again, in a uh, regular team deathmatch, you get a lot of variety, you're not always being killed by the same guy, you're not always getting uh, sniped across the map because there, there's, there was a lot of quick scoping involved, as you can see in the gameplay. Uh, Nick and CDVT were both quick scoping, and these were really fun times in Modern Warfare 3 where me, Trevor, Nick, CDVT, we all go play face off. 
These are some of the most memorable moments I've had in Modern Warfare 3 being, uh, the origins of Swift Gunners, I guess you could say. If you guys don't know what Swift Gunners is, you have, uh, you have no idea who these two people are. But Swift Gunners was our clan, and we were a pretty damn good clan. And, yeah, so, like, uh, yeah, so Face Off, I kind of liked it, but it really wasn't the best game mode for going for Moabs, but because it does take the entire game, I don't think he even gets the Moab until, like, there's two minutes left in the game, and I got my Moab in, I think I was playing Domination, I got that within the first two, three minutes of the, actually, no, I think it was, like, first five minutes of the game, I had a Moab. And this took him the entire game camping with a sniper. I mean, still, it's a good gameplay. I, I haven't gotten a Moab on Face Off, but it's not as fast paced as a Moab that would be, say, on Dome. That would be a lot fast paced and a lot less campy. But, th like I said, it's still a great gameplay getting a Moab on Erosion, but it's just. It's it doesn't take as much skill because all you gotta do is hide in this one building. But don't get me wrong, yeah, it's still a great gameplay. I, I couldn't do it. But because Nick's a lot better of a sniper than I am, does trick shots, I don't. So oh god, he almost died there. I, I don't think I ever actually watched this gameplay back and as his point of view because I was I was in the game, I, I care less what he was doing. And then I remember him going, I I'm Moab! Moab Yeah, so if you guys have not already, deep fry that like button, that subscribe button, favor this video if it was your favorite video, and you click that uh, that Johnny Bravo Minecraft player in the top right, I think, and it'll take you directly to my channel, if you're not already watching this on my channel trailer section, or you could click the video that'll pop up, well, it's been popping up the entire video, bottom left and that'll take you to my most recent video but that 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 would be this video unless you're watching this in the future so if you want to check out my most recent video those are the buttons you're going to want to press i uh fix my copyrights and stuff and oh yeah i am now a uh, part of team hd gaming if you guys want to check them out i'll have a link in the description of this video you guys go check them out drop them a like because they are an amazing group of people and i uh, uh, I'm pretty sure my first video is going up sometime today. It was supposed to go up last night, but we had uh, technical difficulties with the audio track, so I had to re-record that. So if you guys want to head over there and give them a like, subscribe, because I'll be posting over there a little bit. Uh, that'd be great. Deep fry their like button, but uh, deep fry mine a lot more, obviously. <laughs> because I'm the original guy that deep fries. The deep fry guy. And... Oh, here's the Moab in the gameplay right there. 24 kill streak. Nick's just gonna start flipping out. Woo! And I remember Nick just screaming. And so that's the Moab in this gameplay. Yeah, so if Face Off did come back, I probably wouldn't be too overjoyed unless they did what I said and just. I love it. He only got two kills because Joey took one. <laughs> he got a double kill with the Moab. He probably he could have got he got a triple kill in the gameplay without the Moab and got a double kill with the Moab. That that was really funny. Yes. So that's pretty much it. We do obviously we win this game. I gotta go to the bathroom. So deep fry that like button, that subscribe button, face off. Eh, would not be too happy if it did come back unless I did what I said. So I will talk to you guys.